Hello friends, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new, welcome. My name's Shelby, and I'm exhausted. This weekend is Greek skit here at Chapman, and basically, skit is like these little lip sync dancing shows that all the sororities and fraternities put on. Our first show was last night. I'm just gonna start getting ready. It was great, but I just like I just couldn't sleep last night, so I got one hour of sleep. I finally fell asleep at like 12.30 and woke up at like 1.30, 1.45, so it's been great. Okay, so I'm just gonna start doing my makeup and hair for the show and I'll just kinda like fill you in on my life right now. Basically, it's like 8.30 in the morning and um, I had to be there at 10 for like getting ready with the girl, getting more ready with the girls and taking pictures and stuff like that with all of Greek life. Ah. I'm absolutely exhausted. It's kind of fun to be doing stage makeup though because I haven't done it in so long since I did theater in high school. Anyway, so our theme's Great Gatsby. Last night went really well. Um, I play Nick, so I'm kind of narrating the whole thing. It's kind of funny because I can't dance. Um, all the other weeds can dance like really well. I'm just out here trying my best. Okay, let's see. What's new for me for college? Oh, so Abby and I got an apartment for next year. Um, we're gonna be moving in the end of this summer and we're gonna film so many like apartment moving things, apartment tours, fun stuff like that, so get ready. So we basically wrote down our top 15 units that we wanted and we got the first one that we wanted, so that was really awesome. Yesterday I bit my tongue and it started, like I bit it so hard, it started bleeding and it hurts so bad this morning. My eyebrows aren't even. Ugh, I'll fix them in a minute. I always got to put on a bunch of chapstick. I just get so chapped on stage. Basically our thing's just like seven minutes long, but it goes by so fast when you're on stage, like it literally feels like two seconds. And my character is literally on stage like the entire time and I still feel like I have no time for anything. So since yesterday was the first night, it was really funny because um, I stand on a box, so the bottom of the box is painted black, the middle is painted gold, and the top is painted black. And so basically we all run out during like a blackout, so all the lights are off. And I, I walk out, and I can't see my box, it's so dark. So me and this other girl, my sorority, we're literally like feeling around on the stage for my box, trying to find it. Eventually I found it, and literally as soon as I stepped on it, the lights went up. I was so scared and I'm so nervous to try and find it again for today's performances. Okay, so basically our look is really simple. It's just like neutral color eyes. So I have a bunch of just kind of like browns from Bare Minerals. I love Bare Mineral eyeshadow so much. This is my first eyeshadows actually. And you always really want to make sure your crease is well defined. It shows and makes your eyes pop. And then you use like a nice dark brown in the crease and really blend it out so it's natural but it's still definitely there. I like to do my eyeshadow before my foundation. I don't know, I just feel like if there's any fallout, like I can just brush it off easier or I can like cover up any mistakes with foundation or whatever. But some people are really adamant about like doing their face and skin first. I usually do brows, eyes, foundation, bronzer. If I'm doing blush, then blush, then highlight. Oh, and then lip. I'm gonna probably do like my lashes afterwards because you wear fake eyelashes on the stage. Oh, okay, I'll talk about my plans for this summer. So this summer I'm actually gonna be staying down here in Los Angeles. I'm living with Abby's family and I got a job at Universal Studios. So I'm gonna be doing retail there. So if any of my friends are going to Universal, let me know. I wanna meet up with you guys, I miss you. Okay, now for eyeliner. I feel like I didn't wing it out yesterday because my character's a boy. I didn't like do it super feminine, but like if I look feminine anyway, might as well just do a little wing or whatever. I'm surprised my skin is looking pretty clear after yesterday. I had so much makeup on for so long. So our one o'clock show today is kind of like the parents show. So Abby's family is coming. I think I'm gonna do lashes after I do like my makeup. Makeup. You know, dampen my beauty blender. No, I'll be back. Wow, I'm exhausted. I'm gonna go in with some shape tape, cover up all the eye bags and such from no sleep. It's also starting to be like final season, so I have um, 
I have two final presentations on Monday. And of course I've skipped this weekend and then I have Founders Day um, for my sorority tomorrow, Sunday. So I'm gonna have like no time to prepare for them. Even though I have to make PowerPoints and it's a lot. And one of them's like a group project and one of my group mates is out of state and we don't know what we're gonna do for our final presentation now. But honestly, if you can conceal and if you can highlight and contour, like you can totally change your face shape. I feel like I totally just changed that. I'm just gonna go in now with my favorite foundations, just the tart. Amazonian clay, yeah, Amazonian clay one. Just use my ovalate. Really just spread her around. It's a full coverage kind of day. So yeah, I mean, I've pretty much already finished my first year of college, which is insane. I'm not ready for it to be over. Um, and I'm so excited for next year living with Abby, having a new apartment, I have some really cool new Dodge classes, being in my sorority, like just being part of Greek life is something so like exciting and I feel like it's just a good use of my time really. Go Greek? Okay, that looks pretty well blended. Now we're gonna go over with more concealer and highlight the parts of our face that we want to stand out and then we'll go in with contour and really chisel your cheekbones so they're gonna pop while I'm on stage doing my thing. That's something I really miss about high school is doing theater. And like I'm not exactly good enough for the theater program here at Chapman. Um, doing skit with my sorority has been so much fun and honestly Kind of like the same feeling as doing theater. Although it's obviously not as long as a show, but it's really fun seeing what all the different frats and sororities do. Let's 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 Okay, I'm just gonna go in with this super old, like wet and wild bronzer that I got ages ago. Um, I think I've used this for literally like every single show ever. Um going really heavy, honestly, on this bronzer, because God loves to teach makeup, right? So today I watched two movies. Um, I watched my all-time favorite movie, Eternal Sunshine and Spotless Mind. Um, if you haven't seen it, I definitely recommend it. It came out in 2004. It's a Jim Carrey movie about a company that can erase your memories and, like, how it kind of goes wrong. It's really cool. And then I watched this other one. I think it's called What If. It has Adam Driver and um, Daniel Radcliffe in it. It was so different and really cool. I think it's one of my favorite movies now. Honestly, anything with Adam Driver in it is one of my favorite movies now, but <laughs> setting spray. <laughs> this is like my new all-time favorite spray. Too Faced, like the new unicorn one. Like I'm obsessed with all their unicorn stuff because I love unicorns um, and I love makeup. So perfect combination. I'm gonna go with the rainbow highlight from Too Faced. Ooh, okay. I'm actually just gonna do my hair real quick too. Um, her hair is really simple. It's just a high ponytail and straight. My hair is already straight from. A shower last night and just kept it straight so anyway if you go to Chapman or if you go if you're planning to come to Chapman I highly recommend you should go to Greek skit it is so much fun I gotta watch um, the other frats and sororities after we were done performing and just like the energy and the fun stories and the cool themes and the costume Ooh, my costume. It's like this black and gold like lace jacket and I have these gold sparkly shoes. So cute. Ooh, I'm gonna gel my brows into place real quick. I haven't gotten them done in a while. I'm kind of just letting them grow and do their thing. As for lips, I kind of have to do more of a nude type and so I have, this is my all-time favorite lip crayon. I got it from Ipsy Bag. It's a 
Trustique like lip pencil. I don't know. Like I'm gonna be so sad when this runs out because I hope they like make it. Okay, so I managed to get the false eyelashes on. Here is the final look of our Great Gatsby makeup for Skit 2018. <laughs> such an awkward angle. I look bald like a little boy. As always, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and I hope you see a dog today. Mwah.